Hey everybody, welcome to I'm James Cromwell. <laughs> My name is Mo, this is George, and this is where we watch movies and television. In the same space, because yeah. I'm visiting. <laughs> and Yeah, I'm going to be here for the next three weeks or so. Boom, uh, So we're just going to be in the same room for the next little while. Yeah. And uh, you just have to enjoy my presence. Yeah, Yeah. there's nothing to... It's not, it's, it's... A strong fragrance. <laughs> <laughs> you're fine you're good i don't know what's going on <laughs> why i chose to say that oh dignity what is dignity <laughs> i've never heard of it so yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> okay so we're doing contact yes oh Oh, gosh, just dummy. He's just awesome. Well, I'm not a crook. Oh, oh, Radio signals going outwards for the back of time. The time, yeah. yeah. Wow. No, but just, like, the imagery. Yeah. And, like, yeah. what we've seen recently. Yeah, yeah. And, like... Yeah, James Webb, yeah. Copy W9, GFO, <laughs> K4WLD here. Where are you, K4WLD? Come back. Pretty good. Mm. That's farthest yet. Super proto version of online chat room. <laughs> ASL, come back. <laughs> At least you won't get a warranted dick pics. Jesus. <laughs> Saturn, can we talk to Saturn? Mm-hmm. Dad, I love that unicorn poster. Can we talk to Mom? Oh. Shit. I don't think even the biggest radio could reach mm-hmm. that far. She's so adorable. Mm-hmm. If it is just us. Seems like an awful waste of space. Hmm. I'm gonna need a bigger antenna. <laughs> Is that like I'm? We need a bigger boat. We're gonna need a bigger boat. Joke. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. So her grown up. Oh, that's gone now. This place. Really? Yeah. Just disrepair budget. It's oh, gone. that's so sad. Go back. Huh? Right there. Yep. That, that's it. All right. Twelve twenty-one point forty-six. <laughs> It's a large cat out in space. Davio, Dr. Vernon, Dr. Irway. Hey, hey. how you doing? Hey. That's her job, is to like listen and look for... Extraterrestrials, That's yeah. That's so cool. Arecibo, right? <laughs> <laughs> There's a show. Well, isn't he charming? What, um, what are you studying out there? So much eye contact. <laughs> contact. <laughs> Your roll credits. <laughs> Search for extraterrestrial intelligence? Wow. I, I don't make a very good research subject. I'm, I'm just not very quotable. No quotes. No quotes. Just God's honor. Just good meal, good company. My God, they're both so attractive. They really are. <laughs> How is that new office? Oh, shit. <laughs> Ellie, still waiting for ET to call? Oh, jeez. Uh-huh. Then I dropped out of seminary and went off and did some secular humanitarian work. I couldn't live at the whole celibacy thing. You could call me a man of the cloth. Without the cloth. So he's just man of the... <laughs> 400 billion stars out there, just in our galaxy alone. Well, if there wasn't, it'd be an awful waste of space. Oh... Oh my goodness! <laughs> That was a beautiful scene. <laughs> that was so good. How can I reach you? Uh, just leave your number. I'll call you. Am I pessimistic, or I feel like I'm waiting for like the other shoe to drop? Like there's a ulterior motive for him. Like it's too perfect. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like the also, right guy who finds her just at the right time, says the right things. I don't oh. sense that, but Dad. This is where he dies. I'll give the medicine. Oh, so he has like a condition. Like it was something. Yeah. I don't want to be an whoa. asshole, but. Whoa. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't want to be an asshole, but like. Call 911? <laughs> Should have kept some medicine in the downstairs bathroom. <laughs> then I could have gotten to it sooner. Dad, this is Ellie. Come back. Oh my god. Oh, that's heartbreaking. Transmitting on 14.2 megahertz. What? We could put together a kick-ass ad hoc city program. Filmland pulled the plug. We're homeless. (laughs) 
There's nothing out there but noble gases and carbon compounds, and you're wasting your time. It's my life! He said the, the, the things, and he looked at you <laughs> so lovingly. And he looks and he, like Matthew. And he looks like Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> we must confess that your proposal seems less like science than more like science fiction. Science fiction, just things that hasn't become actual science yet. <laughs> I heard of a couple guys that want to build something called an airplane. You know, you get people to go in it and they fly around like birds. It's ridiculous, right? Huh. Science fiction, right? Until, yeah, until... Mm -hmm. Jesus. Ah, the actual money man. Yes. Oh. You have your money. Oh. <laughs> Four years later. Oh my God. Okay. We lost. It's over. If I have to go it alone, I'll go it alone. I've done it before. I mean, I get it though, because like other scientists, other departments, other research have to use it as well. Mm hmm. Having money doesn't mean you get to hog it forever. That's true. As a human race, is the world fundamentally a better place because of science and technology? Yes. <laughs> Lonelier and, and more cut off from each other than at any other time in human history. Wow, and this was 97. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Something she's never heard before. It's got to, right? Like, it's got to be like. Right ascension, 18 hours, 36 minutes. Give me another array status. What do you want me to do about the source queue? Look, forget about it and hold the queue. I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm patched in. All right, let me hear it. How's this playing tonight, guys? Come on. Jesus. You can pick it up on my... All right, all right, it's restarting. Base 10 numbers. Just start counting now. See five. how far we can get. Five, seven. Those are all prime numbers, and there's no way that's a natural phenomenon. Holy okay. shit. Okay, okay. That position is confirmed. We've got 4.4623 gigahertz. Okay, thanks, Ian. Just keep tracking, and we'll get back to you. Yeah, right on. Wow. Yeah. Get them all, the whole planet, mm -hmm. to start listening. Yeah, everyone who does her job. <laughs> Universal language. Who are we gonna call now? Get me the president. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> Close enough. Yeah. Uh, all I can think about is that line from Men in Black. What's that? What is it? Uh, a person is smart, but a, a people oh. are dumb, panicky animals. Yeah, 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 yeah. So. Someone's going to do something stupid. Why the remedial math? Exactly. Why don't they just speak English? Yeah, well, maybe because 70% of the planet speaks other languages. Prime numbers. Uh, that would be integers that are only divisible by themselves and one... It's supposed to be a civilian facility. Huh? You're having sent this announcement all over the world may well constitute a breach of national security. Oh, go f yourself. A civilization sending this kind of message would, would intend it just for America. I'm job. Is to I... <laughs> <laughs> all right, pass the recording okay. into the image processor. Well, I'm with the prime. There's another signal. Looks like a TV transmission. What? Oh, just visuals now. Okay, okay. I freeze. That's a. It's a swastika. Yeah. What the f? What the f? Okay. Uh, what's going on? Oh. Wait, was that the first broadcast? Um, the Olympics, right? The 1936 Olympics. I don't know. Of of the first Olympics. Yep. The new era is open. Twenty million people died defeating that son of a bitch, and he's our first ambassador. <laughs> That's pretty funny, <laughs> actually. <laughs> the Olympics was the first television transmission yeah. of any power that went into space. Or Sig Heil, you're our kind of people. Shut up. <laughs> Why would they know that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. It will surely be one of the most stunning insights into our universe. That's... The president has been in touch with heads of state from around the world. And I'm turning you over to the leader of the scientific team that made this remarkable discovery, Dr. David Drumlin. Oh, what? this guy's going to hog all the credit isn't he massive amounts of data which extend right, right to the higher harmonics whoa the first volume of an encyclopedia galactica instructions <laughs> to acquaint us with their colonization procedures moses with a few billion new commandments oh. god i hate people sometimes that's a testament to the writers of this making characters like mm -hmm. that that we know are so real in light of dr arroway's long experience in these matters for the time being 
She will continue to direct operations at the VLA. So it turns out there's life on other planets. Boy, this is really going to change the Miss Universe contest, don't you? <laughs> has to admit that there are some pretty serious religious overtones to all this. Oh my this God. is yet another example of science intruding into matters of faith. Now they will have a set of places to keep. Many have come to protest, many to pray, but most have come to protest what? Yeah, I don't know. I, I, like, what would you? People are <laughs> such fickle creatures. I know. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's Busey. It's isn't that Gary Busey's son? Oh yeah. From uh, Starship Troopers. Yeah. That you want talking to your God for you. <laughs> Is it Kang and Kodos? Hey, listen, I don't know who you are, but you broke into the database, and I'm. Jesus. I'll be there. <laughs> Mr. Haddon. That's well, John Hurt. I've had my eye on you a long time. Oh. Alien. Oh, shit. I have guests so rarely, it's important to me that they feel welcome in my home. I wish to make a small contribution, a final gesture of goodwill. You found the primer. Over 63,000 in all. Every three dimensional <gasps> page contains a piece of the primer. Jesus. Within the layering of the matrix, we have these basic equations. Oh. That's cool. We now have the symbols for true and false. This was the key, to put it simply, oh, that allowed us to decipher their language. But that simple thing like true and false is so amazing. Uh, advanced uh, communication device would turn out to be some kind of a transport. Transport? Could be a Trojan horse. We build it and it pours the entire Vagan army. Why, Yeah, though? I was wondering when the W word was gonna... <laughs> the default position of the egghead set that Aliens would always be benign. Why is that, Doc? It would be like us going out of our way to destroy a few microbes on some anthill in Africa. The fact of the matter is, we don't even know whether they believe in God. Uh, this doesn't make any sense. What? <laughs> now, if it had been religious in nature, it should have taken on the form of a burning bush or a big booming voice from the sky. God, God, of himself, oh, not in the form of monkey! Jesus, this guy! Okay, he's... It's like you're saying that science killed God. What if science simply revealed that he never existed in the first place? And an all-powerful, mysterious God created the universe and then decided not to give any proof of his existence? Or that he simply doesn't exist at all? Did you love your father? What? Your dad, did you love him? Prove it. Right. And shows an illustration of what is unmistakably a human figure inside a geometric structure yeah. of some kind. Designed to take a single human occupant okay, it's a space. Like a teleporter? Presumably to the star Or like a... Um, take a single human being, right? Into space. So like a... What are they called? The... Well, it would... But 26 light years away to fly there, it wouldn't work. It would have oh. to be. But they're also putting together a formal selection committee. It's just... It's made up of scholars, theologians. I want you to know whatever happens as far as I'm concerned. This guy sucks. Well, good luck. Is he a selectee as well? He just resigned to science advisor. He wants to be the one to go. Right, of course he would. Yeah, because he he's wants, taking over everything from her. He wants the title. He doesn't care about the actual... Meanwhile, months of debate finally Crazy. reached a conclusion of sorts last week as 10 international candidates were selected by the IMC. It should be somebody who's fluent in the language that the message was given in. Uh, science in this case. That this is simply beyond our capabilities, that this endeavor will fail. Now all it uh, requires on our part is... Uh, Faith? I was gonna say a sense of adventure. <laughs> and in breaking news... Hey, don't forget to check out our Patreon for these exclusives. And now back to the movie. Selectors and selectees mingling around. <laughs> Can we talk about Einstein? If it works, and you travel to Vega at even close to the speed of light, when you come back... If you come back. The rest of the candidates and myself, we, we fully understand the implications, the risks that we're taking. Wow. If this is a chance to find out even just a little part of that answer, I don't know, I think it's worth a human life. Somebody has to be on the first ship to sail across the oceans. <clears throat> How did you 
evolve? How did you survive this technological adolescence without uh, destroying yourself? I believe we are ready to move on to your final statement. Uh, Madam Chairman, I have one more question. Oh, he's gonna... Would you consider yourself a, uh, a spiritual person? Is he, like, trying to sabotage? I think so. I don't really understand the point of the yeah, question. 95% uh... of the world's population believes in a supreme being in one form or another. Yeah, so it's... A representative of humanity. Yeah. Okay, I see. I'm proud of what we've achieved as a species. We chose to send a representative who did not put our most cherished beliefs first. Like, has she said yes? And is Judeo-Christian God. Mm -hmm. So then what, you don't represent the Hindus? You don't represent Buddhists? You don't represent everybody yeah. else who don't believe that same God then? Yeah. It's, it's, it's still, still irrelevant. It's still, yeah. Someone who honestly thinks the other 95% of us suffer from some form of mass delusion. Drumlin told you exactly what you mm -hmm. wanted to hear. Yeah, which would you want? Like the one who's truthful or the liar who just exactly. tells you what? Yeah. yeah. Just so. wants the glory. And I promise I will do my best to represent my nation, my planet, and my God on. This God is Krishna. Is it right? <laughs> or Lilth. <laughs> yeah, he didn't say which God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Could be Odin. <laughs> David Drumlin is supervising the on-site portion of the test. We spoke with him earlier today. Didn't uh, expect to see you here. I suppose the fact that I discovered the message means that I have some PR value. Also, just to see the mo monumental event. Yeah. Not everyone's as petty as you. <laughs> All controllers, I need a go, no go for test initiation. Test start. Rigs are unlocked. Power levels indicate a good start. Ring motion detect. Alpha, Bravo, Charlie. 5%. Confirm. We are at 5%. Other people believe it might open up a doorway to some other dimension. You're reading on a first and second order G levels. G levels are right on. Oh. What the f? What the f oh, Saboteur. That dynamics. I think we're okay. You can be there. I know him. Jerry, execute the rapid shut. Oh my god. The tall guy. The technician. See him? The blonde guy with the blonde the eyebrows. Fuck? Hey! Take him! Security breach! Bomb! He's got what? a bomb! Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! I need you to be professional, people! Like, no. like, he looked creepy, but, like, I didn't expect that sort of, like... Straight up terrorist. Yeah, holy f There's always one guy to ruin it for everybody. We do for the goodness of all mankind. We'll vindicate our faith. Look up, enemy. Yeah, I'll put you with that door. Oh, yeah, I was wondering why. Moscow 3215. No Russians so far. <laughs> Is it the insanely rich guy again? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's just in space. He's just in space. The Russian government was kind enough to give me accommodations on Mir. My little room has one hell of a view. Oh, he's built his own, didn't he? What? Yeah. Oh my god. There's a second one. <laughs> Why build one when you can have two at twice the price? They still want an American to go, Doctor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so he just went from villainous billionaire to eccentric billionaire <laughs> yeah oh my god digital microchip good for thousands of hours of recording hey. okay the transmitted specs never said anything about any chair or a, a restraining harness mm -hmm. we are not putting anybody aboard this machine unless there is some sort of minimal protection minimal protection it's never been made public of course it's fast and it's painful. oh shit you could be marooned unable to return <laughs> The reason I didn't vote for you to go, Ellie, was a good reason, but it wasn't the real one. Because I don't want to lose you. The world was stunned by the announcement of the existence of a second yeah, machine. Suck it, Gary Busey. <laughs> that was his son. Or Jake Busey. No reporters whatsoever have been allowed near the site. I would never be chosen, but I was so go. Reminds me of um, like science experiments.
experiments in like elementary school where you have an egg and you have to drop the egg from like a distance and like build something <laughs> to keep it from cracking. The design of everything is so like simple and awesome. Ellie, we're gonna proceed to button you up. Roger control. Ellie, we are go for closure. She has to leave everything. It's insane. I'm go. Here. Nice to smell you again, Mr. Kitts. <laughs> <laughs> Pineapple up in the sky. <laughs> Jody Foster. <laughs> oh no. Ellie, we are showing green across the board. Copy that control. IPV is secure. Yeah. Well, who let you in there, huh? A uh, higher power intervene. <laughs> oh. Ellie, the vibration is normal. We are at 50%, all systems nominal. Jerry, what do you think? I'm still go. People, we are still go. 65%. The material is changing. It's bordering on translucent. Initiating auxiliary booster sequence. We're go for ignition. If you can hear, I am okay to go. Picking up tremendous EMI levels around the machine. All field measurements are pegged off scale high. But, but, but she's, she's there. Okay to go. She says she's okay to go. <laughs> Does that count as, like, verbal confirmation? <laughs> <laughs> Holy oh. shit! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> oh! Yeah. So it opened. It's a wormhole. A wor yeah. <laughs> I'm going through some kind of a tunnel. <laughs> she would know what a wormhole yeah, is. Yes, she would know. What <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> some kind of tunnel. <laughs> I must have gone through a wormhole. There you go. <laughs> Okay. They're alive. Oh, is it like just to show her where they are? Like a tour? Oh. This is our planet. This is where we are. Oh. That's not good. <laughs> is it because they're like, we didn't say to build a chair? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you're supposed to free float inside. Just stand there. Well, because there's no rattling now that the chair's gone. Yeah. So all that discomfort was for no reason. <laughs> yeah. Just because we... Uh, humans always like to think they know better. <laughs> Whoa. She's turning into a child. Is it like a rival? Like, it just completely changes her perception of... Oh, like she's still in it? Oh, this is just like... Like those are the the barriers of the yeah. It's just showing her maybe. Oh, you. oh, I'm sorry. I couldn't be there for you, sweetheart. When I was unconscious, you downloaded my thoughts, my memories, even. We thought this might make things easier for you. Right. So they uh, give her an image that is like Galaxy Quest. Oh my God. Travel here through that transit system that you built. We didn't build it. No, they were gone long before we ever got here. You're an interesting species. You're capable of such beautiful dreams. In all our searching, the only thing we've found that makes the emptiness bearable is each other. I have so many questions. Do we get to come back? But other people need to see what I've seen. They need to see... This is the way it's been done for billions of years. Okay. She is alive. Put her on the PA! Yes, sir. Ellie, just hold on tight. I'm sorry, Ellie. Right. Did you say what day? The IPV dropped straight through the machine. A split second. You didn't go anywhere. But I did. Oh, fuck. No one's gonna believe her. Now, doctor, let me show you what we saw. The IPV dropped straight through. Everyone who watched saw exactly. Not to inflame this situation <laughs> beyond the facts. The president has ordered a special executive inquiry. And yet every scientific instrument confirms the IPV was out of contact for only a fraction of a second. No one's going to believe her. That's infuriating. Yeah. We'd go to all this trouble, bring you tens of thousands of light years, and then just send you home without a single shred of proof. Fake. A, a signal, signal from Vega. You. 
and of course the message itself to put something like this together so say the whole complex thing is drawing on so many different disciplines would be impossible impossible that this was all some kind of a hoax that that he engineered this sr Haddon, are you familiar with the scientific precept known as occam's razor god i hate this guy so much that your experience is the result of being the unwitting star in the farewell performance of one sr Haddon. only a story that to put it mildly strains credibility you admit that you have absolutely no physical evidence to back up your story. Yes. And concede that this journey to the center of the galaxy, in fact, never took place. I was given something wonderful, something that changed me forever. A vision, a vision that tells us that we belong to something that is greater than ourselves. That awe and humility and hope. That continues to be my wish. What do you believe? I, for one, believe her. Oh, Carl Sagan, ever the peacemaker. <laughs> I assume you read the confidential findings report from the investigating committee. I flipped through it. The fact that it recorded static isn't what interests me. Continue. What? Oh. Is that it recorded approximately 18 hours of it. Right. <gasps> <gasps> yeah. You James Woods. He knows it. Holy shit. He knows it. I don't know what. Oh, government gonna be government. 18 hours of static. Right. That's amazing. All the different radio telescopes all over the world. Can someone please and tell her that? Farther into space than anybody's ever heard before. <laughs> oh. Oh man, how you doing? <laughs> I want to curl up and just cry for hours and we're just like i'm so tiny and insignificant uh. <laughs> and the world is beautiful uh <laughs> just dead oh man okay 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 people have seen this movie before are probably like yeah yeah we know but i'm just like <laughs> like she i don't it's so stupid. <laughs> I feel stupid talking about it, but it, like she found like faith in uh -huh. science. So they, they were able, I don't know. It was a love story, guys. It's a love story <laughs> about someone who believed something and she didn't believe something. And then she saw something that made her, got her to understand the way yeah. he believes something. And then they can live happily ever after because it's just a love story, nothing else. Nothing. No, it's like <laughs> surface level love story, surface level sci fi rom com. Yeah. <laughs> um, nothing too deep or meaningful. Nothing controversial. Or wonderful deep or anything. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, just, dig any deeper. just a simple story. Sure. <laughs> uh, it's really amazing. <laughs> now it's a beautiful story. God damn it, Jake Busey. <laughs> <laughs> that part. Holy f. Like, there's. Like, I remember, like, seeing, we yeah, because we saw, like, um, coverage of him, like, images mm -hmm. of him, and we were like, okay, why are they showing him so much? He's a mm -hmm. creepy guy, and it's like... And then he shows up at the platform, you're like, oh. <laughs> I, you know, even when he showed up, I didn't think it could have been that. I didn't, my mind didn't go Saboteur? to that. Saboteur? Yeah. I was just like, oh, he's gonna mess it up in, like, a like yeah. non-lethal way. <laughs> and then, holy f Yeah. Just, like... Non-lethal, famously Brutal. fundamentalist. I, <laughs> I'm so naive. I hate myself. Yeah. James, yeah. So his character James Woods, was, think. yeah, was like antagonistic the entire time, and then until yeah. the very last second, he, I guess, knew that the camera record eighteen hours, but refute, but is like choosing so, to discredit her aggressively. Uh, yeah, that's quite interesting. Yeah, so I'm I'm kind of like wondering why it's like is it is it just comes down to like him trying to make sure that these findings are exclusively American essentially, so it doesn't go out to the rest of the world. Maybe because that's been the horn that he's been like blowing the entire time, right? Mm -hmm. Is that? Yeah, maybe it is like that, like yeah. some sort of like. That's all right. Yeah. Well, that wraps this. <laughs> That wraps this burrito. That wraps this burrito. <laughs> Thanks everyone for joining us. My, <laughs> my name is Simone, this is George, and we're done watching movies. <laughs> okay, we'd like to thank our patron topic guests. Keep doing this. Shout out to Apen Andy, Carl's in charge, AZ10, always dead, uh, Arabian Prince, Ben AM, 
Brandon Mang, Crazy Relative, Crow, uh, Daniel <laughs> Mergulio, <laughs> Dave Adja, Dr. Teeth, Draco Argento, <laughs> Drew Atchison, Eric Gray, Fred the Squeak, Leeple Turtle, I am Jack Star IJ, Jacob Archer78, and James Lee. Thank you all Thanks very everybody. much. Bye. Bye. <laughs>